me. I think this is the right way. Shit, it's not. Okay, morning guys. I'm um, today heading out to go see a uh, supplier for uh, one of the uh, businesses that I'm over here setting up. So uh, excited just to have that meeting and I've got to get there first using the bus system and I have no idea how this bus system works. I, I tried to use the website and it's all in Dutch. On another note, I can't, really can't wait to be able to get a small office over here and just to be able to work from a small office it's going to be so much better than what I've got right now. In the room that I'm working in, it's like a thousand degrees or it feels like that. That's a point, I need to get a fan. Well, there's the bus stop behind me. I've just got to find a number 22. No, it's a number 7, not 22. Alright, I finally got on the right bus. Uh, there's two number sevens, one's on one side, the other was on the other side. But, I'm late for my appointment, but you know what, just on this first occasion I think it's worth it because I really want to know how to get here on a bus. I could have took a taxi, but you know, hey ho. I just got off the bus and I think I'm heading towards it. I'm kind of like using Google Maps to, to guide me. I think this is the right way. It's not. It's that away. I actually made it to the right place. I cannot believe it. I am here. He just had my meeting and some lunch at uh, the company that I'm going to be working with um, and it was re went really, really well. So um, as you can see, there's lots of uh, product around me. Um, it's a massive, uh, massive uh, company um, and I'm going to be based here probably from October. Uh, doing a lot of filming and getting product ready uh, filming wise for uh, the website that I'm going to launch. So um, I got back from my meeting with the company that I'm going to be working with in uh, over here in Almere. Right well I just got to get ready for an interview now. Uh, I've got an interview with uh, Bridget Nelson uh, so I've got her coming on uh, at five o'clock UK time, so I've got a few hours yet. I found this really cool little cafe. I just got myself some cheesecake. It is so good. Wow, it is so warm here. It's so nice. Okay, so just leaving the restaurant now or the cafe now. Uh, I think I found a new spot where I'm actually going to do a lot of my work from now on. Forgot my power charging lead, so uh, yeah, not so good. Well, I've just come to my local media mark shop. I left the cafe. I'm here because I'm trying to find a fan if I can do because my bedroom is stifling hot, man. Oh my god, look at the price of these. Alright, that one then. But maybe not today. I'm gonna I'm gonna shop around. Well, that's pretty pointless. Am I actually buying anything? Nah. But I know how much it's gonna cost now, so I'm gonna go somewhere else to have a look just to compare. All right. Well, I've uh, I've done my interview for today, and I've just popped out now. Uh, you know, I moved over here for many reasons, and uh, okay. So one was I did want a, a fresh start in life. I just. I just wanted to go experience something else and man it's been as it's been the 
I don't know why, but to begin with, it was the, like the f***ing most scariest thing I've done for a long time by myself, you know, to travel and to, to move somewhere where you don't know anybody. And, I, and I've probably said that on it before, but, um, you know, that was a bit of a shock, that was. But I'm, everything's okay now. I'm fine with it. I'm okay with it. I mean, I also came over here as well because of the business opportunity that was here. And uh, the main business opportunity was, um, you know, setting up this uh, new website that I'm going to have and uh, which is going to sell adult products, uh, just, you know, toys. Um, and it, it's not something I've taken lightly. This is something that I've thought about so deeply for so long. And it's taken me a long while just to get to this point to be okay about talking about it on, on the vlog. You know, because the last thing I wanted to do was to upset anyone from my main channel. And um, that wasn't my intent. My intent was to set up a business that was beneficial to myself and other people, or I could have said other people and myself, either way it works the same. And uh, that was a way to give back and, you know, to earn some decent money for once and to use that one day for something better. You know, it's not about just saving it and hoarding the money, I, I, I'd do something bigger with it. And what's sort of come from this idea of um, doing this website is a new type of talk show. A talk show much like Howard Stern. Obviously, you can never be Howard Stern, but it's a talk show like that, in a sense, to, um, oh, what do you call it? You know, to, to an enter entertainment, it's an entertainment talk show, but it's quite controversial, and that's something I'm gonna do, not on my main channel, that'll be a separate channel, and that's come from the idea of doing this, selling these products and doing this website. And you know what? I couldn't be more happy to even think about doing such an idea. It's gonna be amazing. And had I not had followed my intuition to come over here and do this website, you know, the idea for doing a Howard Stern type of show would probably not have manifested. I, I remember I released a vlog uh, about a month ago or more, probably more, about how I had this dream and that I saw in this dream this type of show that I was going to do. You know, and I've been thinking about it. I'm like, well, maybe that show's possible in the future, but maybe it was this Howard Stern type show that I that I. I didn't foresee it as it was, but I saw the option of doing a talk show, how much I would love doing it, and I would really like to do this. And, and this idea, you know, this Howard Stern type show idea, I, I'd probably take it to the States with me, I probably would, but I would never not do my mainstream channel, my, you know, normal channel. I'd never not do my um, uh, spiritual channel. No way, I'd always do that. But, you know, this seems to be the, the way that it wants to go and I'm, I'm flowing with it. Remember what I've said in many interviews is, you know, being spiritual is not being devoid of a human experience as long as one, you're not hurting anybody else and two, you're not hurting yourself. And I'm not doing neither. So today's been an eye-opener. You've got to see where I work and, well, not where I work, where I'm gonna be working from. And you've got to see, um, yeah, just a little bit of my life being over here. So I'm going to love you and leave you and this is going to be the end of the vlog because soon, it's quite late here as well and I'm going to be using the 24 hour gym soon. I would take you there with me, I will do soon. So be kind to yourself, love yourself, be good to each other and I'll catch you soon. Peace.